Hi everybody, this is my day 156, I believe, doing OMAD, eating once a day. It's a form of intermittent fasting for whom of you who is not familiar with OMAD. So basically I'm doing that for a couple of reasons. Main reason is to slim down. Uh, today we're gonna have a little bit of fun and we're gonna try some food. And this is something that I was looking for and apparently it wasn't very hard to find. It is a Beyond Meat, the Beyond Burger. Supposedly is a really realistic burger and a fantastic replacement for meat lovers who wants to go vegan. So I want to try it. It says that the technology used in uh, producing uh, these burgers is extremely revolutionary one. Uh, we're gonna see if uh, it looks, tastes and feels like meat. It's definitely looking like meat. The color is absolutely spot on. So let's open it. And I have my George uh, Foreman grill heating up. Okay, so let's take a look it's unfrozen and it is beautiful it smells like meat not a very strong smell but definitely smells like an animal product more like a hint of tuna really mm. the smell alone is uh, pretty appetizing so let's uh, put it on okay now it says three minutes is plenty so let's wait very uh, great news i lost one pound today i'm back counting calories and uh doing everything i did before that includes a little workout uh, doing push-ups uh, this is uh, my meal for today i ate some beans it's gonna be delicious i believe i'll cut up a little avocado and have it without a bun and with let's see if it's a uh, gems as a real genuine burger it feels right okay so let's see how does it look here oh amazing really look the oil is bubbling and it collects here on the bottom from the look of it i think it could fool a meat lover smell is a different story it is a little bit on the fish side okay so three minutes are up and we are about to take it from the grill to the plate and let it rest for a minute so far it looks very cool okay beautiful let's close it as you can see it's a little dry and truly red, uh, meat-like red. Let's cut it open. Okay, so as you can see, it uh, has this uh, little rare meat kind of color in the middle, which is uh, great. Now to the real taste test. Okay, so it is meaty, the texture is there, and a little nutty, so there is kind of like nuts with the meat, just together, and I like it. Let's pop up another one into the grill. This one goes into my avocado bun. Mm. Now, this one is around 290 calories each. Mm. It is delicious. I love the texture. It is much meatier than any other meatless product I tasted. Okay, so let's have a bite of my burger, which is uh, nothing more than avocado, lettuce, a bun, and a ketchup. I didn't want to complicate it then. Hmm. There is an aftertaste, which is unmeaty and unnatural to meat. It's not exactly 
unpleasant, but it is unusual. You can't mistake it for meat, really. Mm. But it's not bad. Actually, I enjoy the combination in the bun more than the meat because I don't eat bread much. This is so good. I'm missing something crunchy. So instead of rice, let's have us some beans, sprouted soybeans. Mm, delicious. All the flavors have more depth. All the textures are jumping at you. Everything is absolutely stunning. Even the most banal things, like if I eat just simple potato with some sriracha. Not perfect meat, but great burger. Definitely a champion among other vegetarian burgers. This is, comes very close to real meat. In right environment, it's a perfect uh, replacement and just a great meal. So, I do recommend this to anyone who wanna a little rest from meat. That's it for me. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.